everyone, you have tried out Scott Scrapper 105. Before we are talking about ski, you have to tell all the persons that are watching this one thing. Um, remember to just subscribe, press some, somewhere here and uh, you'll see the subscribe, su subscribe button. Nice, now let's talk about the ski. Uh, how was this one? Um, I'll have to say I was a bit disappointed with this ski. And I'm not sure if the reason is how the, the type of skier I am compared to to uh, to, to how how it's supposed to how you're supposed to ski the ski so to say, or it's it's just because we only tried it on the slopes that might also be a reason. Uh, but I felt it being I felt it, it brings you down the mountain, but it's no, more more or less no no joy uh, when it's getting you there. I couldn't really get into the turn so easy hard to carve, thought it being a bit nervous, a bit sloppy, so to say, in the front. Right. So, so I, did, I did, this is not the ski for me, my, um, for me, so to say, uh, actually. And uh, so I hope it's in the future they come with a ski that's more suitable for my, my <laughs> okay. <laughs> so what's your rating for this ski? I would give it a, uh, I'll be quite harsh. Uh, so I'll give it a two for this ski, uh, actually. All right. Thank you. Yes, Fredrik, uh, you have tried the Scott Scrapper 105. Did you like this ski? No, I did not like this ski. Uh, perhaps for this kind of train, but I felt that it uh, was very nervous. It was very hard to put on edge as well. And when you got it on edge, it didn't really feel nice. And uh, it felt like it will just get you down. Uh, but it's a lighter type of ski. It doesn't have any metal in it or anything like that. But even like, but it feels very insecure. So is it anything uh good you can say about the ski or was it only <laughs> bad <laughs> experience but the, the good thing is light so if you want like perhaps some kind of like touring ski or uh, something in that uh, area it can be an option but uh, I wouldn't say compared to the other skis that we have tried that this is perhaps on the weaker end uh, and I was not too happy about it okay so what's your rating I would give it a uh, uh, a low 2.5. <laughs> Thank you, Fredrik. Yeah. Okay, Ole, you also tried this Scott Scrapper 105. Uh, the other test skiers didn't like it so much. What do you think of of it? All right, so it's the first time for me skiing a Scott ski, so I had like no expectations at all, and. It was a bit soft for me, since I've been talking about this before. I like the, the hard, chargy skis with a lot of playfulness still in it. Uh, and this one is... Uh, oh, it's a party <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yeah, it was a little bit soft for me. And uh, yeah, I think it's it's still like a pretty light ski. So it's good for maybe for touring or if you put a, a light binding on. Uh, so, yeah. So what's your rating for uh, the Scott Scrapper 105? I give it a three. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Moa, how was Scott Scrapper 105 to ski on today? This is uh, unfortunately not uh, a favorite. This, uh, I mean, there's nothing particularly bad about it, but they're, they're like the feeling I get when I ski, it's like nothing's really happening. Uh, a bit slow. The, type of a boring ski or? Uh, yes, I'm sorry to say. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what's your rating for this one? It's a three. Thank you. Yes, we are here with Johan from Scott. I'm going to talk about Scrapper 105. Tell me one, uh, what type of ski is this? This is a uh, typical free ride ski uh, for um, big mountains. Even you can do uh, some nice curves in the normal slopes, uh, you know. So, but this is for uh, the big mountains, and uh, the ski is uh, the performance of the ski is uh, very um, lifeful, if I can uh, say in that way. Yeah. And also, it's very, it's a little bit stiffer, also because the the person or the skier on this ski should be have uh, some good backgrounds with a long history in the freeride ski. 
So this is more of a free ride ski than an yeah. on-piste ski. Ex exactly. So the big mountains on this ski. Yes, they also have this ski, the Scrapper 95. It's like uh, almost the same ski, but a little bit easier to ski on, or what? Yeah, do you it's a little bit easier than the 105. So this is more for the uh, the medium skier or the full mountain skier for the medium. Uh, um, yeah, the, the first step in, because the other one is a little bit uh, a little bit harder to ski if you're the first one runner on the free ride on the, on the big mountains. So this is a little bit uh, easier. I have more, uh, it's more lively uh, and the more, you can easily turn up the ski on the, the edge yeah. easier and it's more playful. So you think this uh, ski maybe will perform better here today in Vemdalen than the 105? Of course, if you see also the condition today, it's, uh, this is the ski you should uh, run today with. Okay. So. Thank you again.